The Draker Oxy training device is used to train for emergency situations. We now show you how to reassemble the device. First, prepare the opener. Hook the short metal straps onto the opener and close. The opener clicks when locked into place. Attach the training seal. Push the buckle of the neck band to the end. Close the neck band. Make sure that the two parts are not twisted. Ensure that the hose ring and starter cord are attached to the heat exchanger. Assemble the heat exchanger. Position the heat exchanger so that the mouth guard of the mouthpiece is pointing towards the breathing bag. Attach the breathing hose to the training heat exchanger. Push the O-ring of the breathing tube onto the heat exchanger. Adjust the buckles of the chest strap to the end. Fold the chest strap like an accordion and fix it with an elastic band to the side opposite of the buckle. Attach the protective goggles to the button loop and the button loop to the functional unit. the breathing bag on top of the functional unit. To do this, place the training device so that the breathing bag is free. Fold the upper edge of the breathing bag down and the lower edge up. Fold the first corner to the middle and the second corner under the first corner. Place the folded chest strap on the breathing bag. Fold the third corner to the middle, then the fourth. Place the device housing on the folded breathing bag. Guide the breathing hose behind the neck strap to the mouthpiece cap and insert the cap into the mouthpiece. Pull the starter pin through the eyelet of the neck strap and insert the pin into the mounted holes on the starter. Twist the breathing hose in and clamp it between the connector and the breathing bag. Spread out the neck strap. Hold the heat exchanger firmly and attach the breathing hose to the functional part. Put the neck strap over it and hold it tight. Place the drawstring over the functional part and hold it firmly. Insert the functional part into the lower part of the housing. Place the neck strap on the functional part and turn the packing aid over. Insert it between the bottom part of the device and the edge of the packing aid. Place the yellow tab on the heat exchanger. Place the upper part of the housing on the lower part of the housing. The indicator window should point towards the opening in the packing aid. Grasp the lower straps on the D-ring, pull it up a little and hook it into the upper straps. Repeat this step on the other side of the training device. Your training device is now ready for use again.